What am I doing? What's going on everybody? We're back working on the Rebel today. The turd, as I like to call it. Um, I did ride it one time. That happened. Um, it was great. I ran out of gas. So, going to wire up the tail light and then I'm going to start sanding and hopefully get it painted this video. That would be great. There's a huge dent right there. We have to take care of that. And the previous owner painted right over the original stickers. So, that's something to take care of as well. Let's get to work. Okay. So, got three wires on these tail lights. Got a ground. We got a power. Sorry, the yellow is the power in this situation for some reason. And then the red is the brake light. So obviously you have to have a running light and a brake light. Really just need to have ignition power on these two. And I need to run this over to the brake switch on the foot pedal. Okay, I got it working. License plate light works, that lower works, and obviously if I give power to this other wire, I got a brake light. But I don't know which wire is the signal for the switch, because I'm out of wires. So I need to find out which one it is, but I don't know which one it is. So I gotta find it out. I'm gonna figure it out, okay? Well, I thought my camera was fixed, but it's not. So I did a nice time lapse of me wiring that up, and it looks like crap. I figured some people would see the time lapse and be like, oh, why didn't you hide the wires better? Well, why don't you shut up? Okay, got jumper cables on it because the battery's dead. I think I need a battery. It's a U also, that's going to hurt, but whatever. This thing's been sitting for a day or two, not starting it. I think I wrote it before I did all the stuff for the first video. Uh, so it's been sitting for a couple days. Um, Listen to this. It's beautiful. Maybe not. It's got to warm up, but it's mint. So we gotta take it all apart. These have to come off, fender's gotta come off, and the tank's gotta come off so we can start prepping for paint. Let's do it. I went to undo the gas line and I broke it, so now the gas line needs replaced. So, check that. Man, it's good I didn't tighten these up very far. I mean, Obviously that was done on purpose, so it was easier to take these off. You know, I could get the right size bolt for this, or socket for this, but why would I, right? Oh, never mind, it's really tight. All right, we'll get the right size one. Is this the right size? <laughs> that's not the right size. Oh, that's the one right there. That is the Johnson right there. Also got this fender here which is purple and red underneath for some reason we're not painting the bike purple but i just thought i'd show you that because we're going to sand this down yesterday i did the i'm not going to show you because you can't see it yet but the two fenders are sitting right there they look pretty decent um this does not as you can see we had to start grinding the paint off because there is about seven or eight different layers of paint here. So I got some chemical stripper. We're going to put that down, get the rest of this paint off, and then give it a good sand and put down um, a good primer. And then we're going to lay the paint over top. That way we can seal off the bare metal so it doesn't rust like it's starting to already. Okay, it's already starting to lift there, you can see. I put a light coat on everywhere over here where it's visible. Um, couldn't exactly get under there so we're gonna have to do two coats of it possibly three i want to get some on that yet and then i'm gonna get away from it because it really stinks <laughs> okay this is like four coats in um the stuff is not as good as it used to be let me tell you but it's getting there we we'll keep going okay i just got off work um we got 
it down to the la the original paint and you can see somebody did a really bad job of painting it because it still has clear coat on it like crazy so um the paint is very brittle and we're still bare metal up here um i'm not trying to make this look perfect we're just trying to get it to look half decent so i'm going to start sanding on this and see how it goes if it's really bad i guess we'll decide what to do from there but here goes nothing <laughs> This isn't looking great, but it's not looking terrible. So um, I gotta let this dry for quite a while and then fill this dent and this dent. I can't exactly pop that out. So I'm just gonna have to fill it with Bondo. Who cares, right? It doesn't matter. We are getting some cleaning done over here. Nice and shiny. There's the actual bike. It cleaned up really good. Tomorrow I'm going to work on just the tank because everything else is done except for a few minor things that I have to finish up off camera before we trade like the battery, um, ignition switch, and the turn signal flasher. So I'll do that stuff off camera because it's pretty simple things to do. Tomorrow I'm going to work on the tank. We'll do a video of uh, me finishing up the paint, putting the bike back together, and then some pretty cool glam shots, I guess. But the tank uh, turned out really good after the epoxy primer and filler primer to fill in the grinder scratches. Um, we still need to do the body work. We'll sand it down at 220, and then we'll lay another epoxy primer and uh, maybe a filler primer before we paint it. But that should turn out halfway decent. I should be pretty happy with it. And then uh, we can go ahead and make that trade. We're going to be trading it for something that's I mean, I consider more valuable for myself. So, go ahead and uh, tune in for the next uh, video. Should be uh, about two days or so. We'll get it done, and then that, that project will be completely done, and then we can start on some other things. Some other things. Um, we also have to finish the GTI and the Miata. Um, I believe this coming Monday, I'm going to put a video out um, concerning what cars I have and what cars I'm getting rid of because uh, I'm definitely getting rid of a lot of things and uh, I'll go over that in uh, Monday's video. So have a good one. Like, comment, subscribe. I think that we've already done.